Good afternoon, pineapples, is what I would say if I was insane. Well, I'm actually, or you join me rather, in the bathroom. I say bathroom, but there isn't even a bath in here. What a strange turn of events. It's a toilet, isn't it, in the US of K? Uh, yeah, I'm sat on the toilet, uh, the lid's down, I have pants on, so I'm not in mid-poo or anything. I just found that yesterday, with me wandering around, it was a little bit choppy and it was dark in places, so I thought I'd update you in the light of the bathroom. Because I'm nice like that. Yeah, I had a busy day today, you know, working in that land. and didn't realise how centralius that Stuart for central. I was, I was bang in the middle. I saw the big clock tower that Big Ben lives in. Uh, the church that the parliament people live in. Lots of policemen. All kinds of stuff. A river, just like the one in Lancaster, but a bit bigger. So yeah, it was nice to be sort of in the middle, in the sort of touristy bit. Some weird guy with a clapperboard thing on saying how corrupt the Metropolitan Police were. You know, no stuff like that. And guess what I did? Because I'm hilarious, I stood next to Big Ben. You know, the gigantic clock tower. And I asked this guy, I said, excuse me mate, do you know what time it is? <laughs> and he actually looked, told me it was about quarter past one or something. And I just went, <laughs> lol. And he just looked at me weird and walked off and I remember thinking like, yeah, I'm stood next to a gigantic clock tower. It's just weird though, because it's an automatic response, isn't it? If someone asks you the time, you tell them it. You don't go, excuse me, there's a gigantic world famous clock immediately to your right that's probably recently just struck. But uh, I just thought it was quite funny. I was gonna go around asking everybody, but I didn't really have the time. Time, clock, tenuous link. I just was, I nipped out very quickly, grabbed some sandwiches, legged it back to training, and I was chatting to uh, the Mr. Lavin, my mate Phil today, and he was kind of saying, why don't you ever do any videos when you're out and about with work and stuff? Generally speaking, I don't really have the time because the only time I ever get is when I'm finished at the end of the day and I'm in my hotel room and I'm just kind of, ugh, chat to you, and the next day, suited, booted, out the door, boom, down the street, bang, into the training session, skabow, that's a new word that I just created, you know, I'd like to do that into the training session, professional, super duper, mega teacher mode, come out, Guinness, food, room, validio. Uh, that's a new, another new word that I created there. I hope you keep in count of these new words. I think in the grand scheme of things, I've invented about 20 shimenikodani, new word, another new one there, it's a number for lots, if you can't actually think of a specific number. So yeah, I've had my tea, I've had a few drinks, I'm back in my room, Tomorrow night, I'm heading back up to Lancaster, because that's where I live. It begins with the letter L, same as London, only it's nicer. It's a bit smaller, but it's just nicer. I like this place, I think it's a fantastic place to visit, but it's a much nicer place to leave. Because it's a bit too hectic, a bit chaotic, things are expensive, nobody speaks English, everyone carries a gun, all that kind of stuff goes on. So I just think it's nice to get back to your own little Little town, rather than a big city, little town, close to the Lake District, close to all the beautiful scenery, picturesque areas. London's nice, but people speak weird. They don't understand people like me. And I must admit, my video voice is nothing like my real voice. Because when I talk, I'm like, right, sort of like, you know, I talk like that. I don't, I don't talk like that. That's ridiculous. I, I do put that voice on from time to time, but generally speaking, I'll, let me try and do my normal voice. Hello. My name is Stuart. This is how I normally speak. This is my normal speaking voice. No, it's not. I, I, don't know. I don't know what my normal speaking voice is. I am being, you know, that sort of patronising mode that I sometimes go into. I'm kind of doing that today. And I don't really know where that comes from. It's a bit annoying. It's a bit stupid. Generally speaking, when I'm teaching people, I don't talk like this. Why am I doing it now? I have no idea. So let's stop doing it, because it's a little bit annoying. Thanks for that. And why do I do that where I close my eyes and it, my, my forehead goes all crinkly and I practically shut my eyes? No idea. Goodness me, is my eyes bloodshot? I bet they are. Can you see me? Well, well, yeah. I am tired and I think we'll be getting the noise to noise. To noise. Because uh, we got up at six. I always get up at six when I stay in these places. I don't know, it just gives me time to unwind and have a bit of a relax. 
I had a bit of a chat with a golfer from Kentucky this morning, old text chat, which was nice because obviously our time differences allow us, or don't allow us to bump into each other much. So it's nice to have a bit of a catch up and text. I still haven't done one of these Google Hangouts with you crazy cool YouTube guys because um, I'd like to do that because it's real time, isn't it? It's like, again, I'm, do I'm recording this now, but this is the present to me. When you watch it, it's the past to me. And we share that moment in time where past meets present and things and stuff and fingers and knuckles and noses. Goodness me. Right, um, I haven't actually said anything yet, which is a little bit silly. Dare I look at how long I've been recording for? Five minutes, 50 seconds. What? Do you know what I mean? I'm gonna have to go. I can't keep you on. You I really appreciate you dedicating five minutes and about six minutes of your time to watching me talk to myself while I sat in the toilet in my pants with the lid down on the soilet. Soilet. It should be called soilets, shouldn't they? Well, I'm not actually pooing. Thanks for doing that. Really appreciate it. Um, I'm going to go now because it's been too long for you to even sit and watch this. And I haven't really taken many breaths, have I? You'd think these things were scripted, weren't you? Well, no, you wouldn't think they were scripted because if they were scripted, you'd expect them to be good, wouldn't you? And they're not. So... Without further ado, let's get out of here. Now this is difficult with a mouse pointer. I'm gonna go out here and do this like I did yesterday. Bye! <laughs>